welcome here in Munich at the Intersolar. We are at the booth of Costel and next to me is the product manager Thomas Garber, who is responsible for the Pico CI. Thomas, what's new about the Pico CI? Yeah, we almost one year ago brought this product to the market, but already now we could increase the DC power or the DC uh, uh, string currents of this inverter so that we can manage now up to 18 amps per DC input for the new module generation of 210 uh, millimeter wafers or for the more common uh, household applications 108 cell uh, 400 watt wafers so that the inverter is prepared for every application. I've heard that the Pico CI does speak kind of a new language. What does that mean? It's, yeah, it's not a language, it's more a protocol, but the protocol, let's say, is a language. Uh, we are talking here about the SunSpec protocol, so one of the only standards in the world for PV inverters. This is now fully implemented and tested, and uh, then the inverter is compatible with every other device talking SunSpec, like data loggers, park controllers, or any other device. It's so perfectly fine when the hardware and the software work smoothly together. Are there any other news from the Pico CI? Yeah, yes, we also have some video tutorials uh, prepared that you can uh, watch on YouTube on our YouTube channel, for example. So sometimes it's better to see how it is mounted or something done than only to read it from the manual. And especially Germany is so strict. So do you think in the future there will be more controls about the PV plant? I think so. So especially Germany has some strict uh, rules and grid codes. But I expect that in, uh, in whole Europe you will see more and more like these rules. Uh, and it depends on the amount of renewable energy in the grid. And I think this will drive also grid operators in different European countries to increase their standards as well. So thanks for all the information out of first hand. And if you don't want to miss any YouTube tutorial or any video, then please subscribe to the YouTube channel, leave us a like and share the video.